everybody, it's Jason Shattuck with PremierGuitar.com and we're at the Lotus Pedal Designs booth at Summer Nam, and that was Mason Stoops demoing Sean here's new pedal, the Ice Verb. So Sean, tell us a little bit about this uh, new reverb pedal you guys have. Well, it's a digital reverb pedal designed to emulate classic spring reverb sounds. Uh, it was designed to be an always-on reverb pedal uh, with thoughts, uh, you know, many of the boutique, boutique amps that are coming out nowadays don't come with reverb, so it's designed as an always-on reverb for that style amps. Two simple controls, one, uh, the control on the right is for reverb intensity, the control on the left is the glamour control, and the, the glamour control basically takes all the way up, there's a lot of high end and sparkle in the trails, and as you dial it down, it takes the high end out of the trails for a more dry, full sounding reverb. You can hear how full and rich the reverb is, you know, extremely lush sounding. As you dial back the glamour control, you'll hear the high end coming out of the trails. And it makes it a real dry, full, bottom end heavy reverb sound. You can also dial the intensity back. You, know, you, you dial them both back all the way. It's, it's a real dry, not really in your face reverb, but there's still some reverb presence. So the controls are very usable for the entire range on uh, both controls. So it's you know works for any playing style really. You know, there's hardly any trail at all, but there's still a lot of bright end and a lot of presence with it like that. And then you can turn it up for you know kind of the surface rockability kind of reverb sounds. Uh, street price on the Ice Verb is going to be $179, and it will be available as of July 31st. And you also brought two kind of prototypes that you're working on for people to also check out. Can you give us a little kind of sneak peek about each one of these two pedals? Yeah, the THD Plus N is a lo-fi buzz pedal. It uh, can do a very hollow lo-fi fuzzy sound, and it can do that whole dying, you know, kind of broken sounding fuzz tone from those classic 60s fuzz pedals. I'll show you some of that. Left knob dialed back, if you play a little bit Mason, it'll... Sounds extremely hollow and not really fuzzy compared to, you know... Takes a lot of the harmonic content out of the, out of the tone, but if you dial that up... Raw 60s style garage fuzz tones that everybody's come to love. The updated version of the Yellow Delay that we're hoping to have out by the end of August, uh, tonally it is very similar to the original Yellow Delay. We did add a fourth knob to it which allows the pedal, when the, the knob's all the way up, it allows for infinite repeats and some self-oscillation. You can hear the repeats are going and they go on and on and on, and then they'll start to self-oscillate depending on the style of music you're playing and stuff like that. You can hear a little bit of the oscillation now. And when, when were you expecting those two pedals to kind of be available? The new version of the delay will be available by the end of August, and we're hoping to have the THD plus end out in October. Excellent. All right, Sean, thank you so much for showing us your new pedals. Thank you. This is Jason Shadwick with PremierGuitar.com.